This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello there, I'm Virginia Cha with this ABC 10 News update. The effort to remove Governor Newsom from office has failed. Projections show Newsom easily surviving the recall vote. Many saw this election as an opportunity to find out if voters would penalize Newsom for setting strict COVID-19 policies. Newsom's leading Republican opponent in the election conceded defeat last night. The branches of the military have set their deadlines for service members to be vaccinated for COVID-19. Those deadlines look like this. The Army will require all active duty members to be vaccinated by December 15th. National Guard members have until next June 30th. The Air Force set November 2nd as the date for active duty members. And the Navy and Marines both setting November 28th as a deadline for their active duty members to be vaccinated. As of last week, the Department of Defense said 1.1 million service members have been fully vaccinated. Joe Musgrove is being honored for his contributions to the community. He has been a Padres pitching ace this season, throwing the first no-hitter in franchise history. And now the La Mesa native has been named the Padres nominee for the 2021 Roberto Clemente Award, which goes to a player who demonstrates exemplary character, community involvement, and philanthropy. Musgrove will get that honor of wearing Roberto Clemente's number 21 when he takes the mound against the Giants. And you can help him win the award by voting for him on the MLB website. We are seeing some beautiful weather out there, Megan. It certainly is a lot more comfortable too. not only cooler, but much drier as well. Temperatures this afternoon trending near to actually below normal for this time of the year. That means low to mid 70s out the coast, low to mid 80s inland, upper 70s to low 80s in the mountains. Still pretty hot in the desert areas, right about 107 and it will be breezy and dry, gusty at times even for the mountain and desert areas, leading to elevated fire danger. Morning clouds and patchy fog will be the story into the weekend as well as those cooler temperatures, but those clouds will be clearing out to sunny skies. Overall, it's going to be feeling like fall for the last week of fall. Virginia. Oh, that's appropriate. Thank you, Megan. For the latest news, weather and traffic, just go to 10news.com or you can download our free app from your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Virginia Shaw.